Let's convert 3 and 1 half to a decimal. And there's a few ways we could do this. First, we could get this to be an improper fraction. So 3 and 1 half, we could take 3 times 2 plus 1. So 6 plus 1 is 7 over 2. And that's an improper fraction. Now we could just take 7 and divide that by 2. So here's our 7. We're going to divide that by 2. 2 goes into 7 three times. 3 times 2, that gives us 6. And now we have 1. Now we can put a 0 here. Move that down. 10. 2 goes into 10 five times. So 3 and 1 half as a decimal, that is 3.5. Here's the other way you can do it. You can think of 3 and 1 half as 3 plus 1 half. That equals 3 and a half. But now we have this 1 half here. We could just convert 1 half to a decimal. So 3 plus, if we divide 1 by 2, that's 1 half, we get 0 0.5. 3 plus 0 0.5, that's 3.5, just like we found before. So once again, 3 and 1 half as a decimal, that's going to be 3.5. So either one of those ways works, and you can check your work with a calculator if you want to be sure. This is Dr. B converting 3 and 1 half to a decimal. Thanks for watching.